DevOps Party Games Edition, uh, DevOps Party Games with the most extreme Kubernetes Challenge Edition, Session 1. This is amazing. If I had a button, if in thought would about a button, we'd have just excitement and clapping. Uh, otherwise, Ian and I are just going to golf clap whenever we need to. This is our joining. We'll do some snapping. This is all great. All right. So, again, welcome to DevOps Party Games, uh, Kubernetes Edition. Uh, because if we didn't have Kubernetes, we would get more sleep. That's right, Jeremy. But like anyone's sleeping these days anyway. And thank all of you who've joined us for a special episode of DevOps Party Games, Kubernetes Contributor Celebration Edition. We're super excited to be here. Absolutely. And so I'm your host, Jeremy Meese. I am I am Jerdog on Twitter. And my co-host. Uh, hi, I'm Ian Coldwater. I am Ian Coldwater on Twitter. <laughs> And honk. Yep, we are hosting isn't honk. That, isn't that a requisite? We just honk whenever we somebody says Ian, we're just supposed to honk, I think is oh. the, the thing. OK, honk. I didn't get yeah. the memo. Honk. OK, well, I, I just made the memo, so you'd probably get it sometime. All right. You want to continue with us? Yeah. Um, so if you've tuned in before to DevOps Party Games, welcome back. If this is your first time joining us, let's explain a little bit about how this show works. We'll be playing two games. We'll be playing Quiplash 3 and Drawful 2. Um, but we made the prompts for these games ourselves, so they're Kubernetes related. Um, yeah, so our fantastic set of players that we're going to uh, intro here very shortly, who are nicely waiting into the green room, uh, patiently, hopefully waiting, uh, they're gonna strive to entertain you, or at least themselves, uh, while you know taking part in the uh, most extreme Kubernetes challenge edition. It's going to be fantastic. So all players and chat participants are asked to abide by the Kubernetes code of conduct, uh, which you can find uh, at the, um, Ian's quickly typing this to me. You can find the Kubernetes code of conduct somewhere on the internet. Just search for it. I'm sure yeah. you know, whatever comes up is, is probably the code of conduct. If not, you can go to devopspartygames.com and there is the code of conduct there that will work. And be you can find uh, the Kubernetes code of conduct on the Kubernetes GitHub repo. <laughs> oh, good. It's in GitHub. Great. So please remember that, yes, we do have this code of conduct, but the game itself, is the rating is M for mature. Uh, during each game, you, the audience, will find a code on the screen and or we'll let you know the code where you can join the audience. And what that's going to give you is... Uh, the ability to you know go to load up jackbox.tv in a browser or your phone can work great for this. You'll enter that code, and this is how you can participate and hopefully influence how the game goes and potentially the ultimate winner for this episode, which I'm sure will have some big crazy Kubernetes uh, prize package for the winner uh, of stuff that they probably already have. Uh, so we'll figure that out. But uh, also. If you're tweeting about the show, and we hope you do, please use the hashtag, hashtag, I think I just said that twice, DevOps Party Games. Shout out to our wonderful mods in the chat, uh, Kat Cosgrove, who is also our guest. And let's get to it and introduce today's contestants. First, we have uh, Tabitha Sable. Tabby is my co-chair in Kubernetes SIG security and is all around awesome. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. You can uh, see me on Twitter if you want to at the uh, handle that's there next to my name. Excellent. All right, next up we have uh, somebody that's new to Kubernetes, uh, just also new to live streaming and new to using webcams. Uh, Kelsey Hightower. Kelsey, say hi and introduce yourself. Awesome. I'm Kelsey. I'm, I'm just trying to get into this Kubernetes thing. So I actually don't even know why I'm here right now. I just got a DM from Ian about an hour ago. So I don't know what this is all about. Thanks for being here, Kelsey. <laughs> Thanks. Um, next, we have Kat Cosgrove, also known as Ian Coldwater, when uh, Kat has different hair on. So hi, Kat. Great to have you here. Hi. Hi, other Ian. Uh, yes, I'm the official community uh, Ian Coldwater uh, cosplayer slash impersonator, though I'm not actually paid for the position like many professional cosplayers are. Uh, I do this as uh, a service for Ian so that hopefully they uh, get a few minutes to themselves at <laughs> conventions and conferences. Chase me instead. That's Love you, Kat. Uh, all right. And then we have Pineapple Pizza's best friend, 
pop. Uh, listen, uh, Jeremy, I'm actually going to go ahead and not be on the show now. Peace, everybody. Good to see you. <laughs> love you all. You know, Kelsey, what, Apple good luck with that Kubernetes stuff, all right? <laughs> we love you, Pop. Thanks for coming on. <laughs> and next, we have uh, Celeste of Cloud Native Computing Foundation and uh, Working Group Naming. Celeste, we're super excited to have you here. Hi. I love party games. This is the best. <laughs> We just heard that the stream isn't up on our end. That uh, probably ping, for those that are watching, probably ping Jeff, uh, who should be checking that on the YouTube side. The stream should be up on Twitch. Uh, I can confirm that it is not. up on Twitch. Yeah, um, it is up on Twitch. So my guess is it's probably YouTube. And it, that would be, uh, Jeff will need to kind of ping that, figure out what's going on there. So Somebody might also want to ping George because I think George has been taking over for Jeff today. Ah, okay, so ping George. Everybody ping George. If you're watching this, just ping George and say hi. Uh, and, and thank George for everything George does. Okay, so we are now ready to introduce, uh, we have Brandon joining us. Thank you for joining us. Introduce yourself, tell us a little about yourself. Uh, hi, I'm Ian, uh, sorry, uh, Brandon. Um, <laughs> I'm B. Dimchef on Twitter. I send people a lot of stickers in the mail, so uh, find me and I'll send you a sticker like this one. It's a lovely design. Oh Brandon. my goodness. Oh, it's a lovely, lovely design. Yeah, hey, someone who cool made this. <laughs> Got the layers of meta here. It's, it's deep. <laughs> Um, next, we have <laughs> Even Augustus, uh, KubeCon co-chair and Cake Eater extraordinaire, also SIG release chair, and a million other things. Steven, we're excited to have you here. Introduce yourself. What's, <laughs> what's up now? I'm still cracking up from everyone else. Uh, I'm learning Kubernetes. Happy to be here, too. Uh, Steven Augustus on Twitter. Uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's uh, yeah, do stuff. Did I hear Cake eat? I didn't know that was a, a like a... Uh, a position inside the Kubernetes Foundation or Kubernetes absolutely, community? Absolutely, absolutely. Okay, then I, I guess I'm having to join now because well, apparently like, Jeremy I, pineapple I like... pizza eating is on the list as well. I mean, oh, you know, see, I'm by the way, better. Smash nice. that like and subscribe button. Popcast pop. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. So, uh, last but certainly not least, adding to the stream is Christoph. We'll go ahead and introduce yourself. Tell us about yourself. Uh, hi everyone, I'm Christoph Lecker. Uh, I am an apprentice cake eater. I'm not like pro like Steven, uh, but wor working my way up, hoping to make senior one day. Uh, you can find me at Toffee on Twitter. He's also on the right. Kubernetes steering committee, although he's not admitting to it. So I have a question, which is if nah. you're an apprentice cake eater, are you a pro toffee eater? Um, no, because that... that... <laughs> That's cannibalism. Not cannibalism. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not down with that. That that's not condoned. That's usually uh, looked down on in some cultures. So might want to be careful there. All right. So uh, we are now ready to get going. Uh, all of the con all of our contestants, our participants, uh, are ready to uh, get in here. For those again uh, that are watching, um, definitely you know. Uh, Thank the uh, the mods and those that are participating in the chat, and uh, let's get going. So, if you want to, uh, I think pop. If you want to go ahead and hit everybody's in, Jeremy, it'd be my pleasure. Go. Thanks so much. Thank you. Hit that pineapple pizza button. Well, apparently, <laughs> you're this isn't working. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hitting everybody's in. Everybody's in. Button. It doesn't work. Hit the Pellegrino button, Pop. Computer, right? I swear, I'll share my screen. It's uh, it's not going. Uh, it's not? Uh -uh. Haunted. Haunted. It's haunted. haunted. <laughs> well, I'm going to share my screen here. Uh, oh, you all see this? <laughs> no. Refresh your browser. Okay. Maybe delete the pod. I hear a cat. There it we really go. Press this button. The game. Oh, there, there we go. go. You have to right. there go. Cool. Wait, I don't see okay, it. So it's not loading on my phone yet. <laughs> ah. Is 
See what happens when you mention pineapple pizza in me? It just doesn't mix. It doesn't mix. I think you sabotaged it. I think this was an intentional sabotage. You know me all too well. Very sus. I fault for breaking out the pizza. Incredible. <laughs> all right. So. All right. So it's time for round one. You'll see two prompts on your device. Answer each one with a dev with a response. Yeah, it's you can read the screen. You're good. Um, and if you are watching from the audience, um, you can join as audience too, and you can vote on the best things, which um, makes points and is fun. Also, feel free to interact on Twitch chat because we are here to interact with you. Excellent. So right now, what the each participant is doing is they are entering in hopefully some quippy responses to the comments that are out there and then each uh, we will be voting yeah. on who has the best comments who's the most interesting uh who is most funny uh knowing your audience is a very important piece of this as well so there's been in in it has not been uncommon for some of these to appear as t-shirts or to be reshared. Uh, so enjoy. Getting down to 40 seconds. So we only have nine people. Now, this is what's, what's interesting is we have nine people who have joined the audience, but we have 27 people who are actually viewing the stream. Uh, that does, that's only a 30%, if my numbers are correct, that's a 33%, uh, acceptance rate that is going up, but it really should be higher. So, uh, what, what do you say to that, Ian? I think that people should join the audience. You can put in code C O E D coed and, um, come hang out because it's really fun. That's right. And then you'll be able to vote on your, on the responses. It looks like Matt Stratton has said that he's joined the audience. Yeah, I reloaded and it, right. and it went well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. The next SIG everyone is joining. Ian Replication or SIG Cake? Mm. Good. Okay. Gosh, I don't know. Who put Ooh. the dash in Sig which, which cake though? Like I got it. Yeah, this is Who put the, the dash. Yeah. Is, I got a so style net here. I <laughs> know that the Cognitive Computing Foundation style guide says that Sig does not have a hyphen in it. However, Ooh. Ian replication is correctly written. <laughs> oh, thank you, did thank you just, where's the audience did you just though? Did the style guide? I did sure as hell did. Okay. <laughs> Um, next prompt, rejected KubeCon talk ideas. Um, choices are my actual submission last time and Dracker Noir and the Kube API, oh, that smell. So, I, feel like, I feel like people are just going to get uh, conference talk ideas for this at this point. Uh, I feel like at least one of these has far too many layers of meta uh, to... Yes. To be yes. like broadly, that's right. Audience However, it is audience noir, favorite, baby. So. That audience favorite does come back to to help you overall. So the most embarrassing event, Bob, whoever Bob is, accidentally put on the community calendar. Uh, Kelsey, what did you do? Didn't I have no idea. Uh, computers are just not my thing. Fair enough. <laughs> okay, so I'm no, in the audience now. Oh, no code is the answer. No code is code. Depression as code. Uh, no code is pretty good. I feel like yeah, we have at least one no code partisan in the room. Well, I'm in the audience, <laughs> so I'm like voting on my answer. At this point. <laughs> <laughs> Steven, my man. <laughs> it's you and me with depression is code. <laughs> oh, no. Service oh, good Lord. I know. What, was, what is service mesh? An important tool in cloud native cheese. And Oof. I mean, what isn't it? <sighs> Those it's are both what good. you want it to be. These are both, <laughs> both good. Um, I mean, what isn't it though? Yeah. Yeah. I thought service I'm mesh sure. was friends we made along the way. I don't know about you. That's the real service <laughs> yeah. mesh. Wow. <laughs> Unanimous. Dominating. Dominated. Dominating. Just absolutely bodied. <laughs> I mean, if I got to lose Harsh, I'd rather do it to him. Yeah. What's your take on Kubernetes? Should have been written in Bash, and no answer from Kelsey again, who has no take on Kubernetes, clearly. 
Oh my <laughs> god, this is just that like... might be completely no answer. The last place you'd expect to see Kubernetes running is to the corner store or my toaster. There was that guy at the corner, corner store who and, recognized and yet, me from the internet. So I'm pretty sure and, and it's actually you, my toaster. And those of you from New York, they are saying bodega. Okay. Bodega. Exactly. Bodega. bodega. Oh, my corner store is actually called the corner store. Like, that's the sign outside of it. It's nice. literally the corner store. Yeah. I'm pretty there. sure there are toasters running Kubernetes. Just, that's just probably, yeah. There have to be. Yeah. Yeah. They should be in marketing. Oh, no. But SRE actually does. Coop cuddle or no answer. <laughs> so apparently doesn't know. Coop cuddle wins. I, I dislike the answer so much. <laughs> All right. All right. Round one. How did the score end up? Brandon. Hey, Steven. 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 Nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Helped along by the audience. Okay, everybody put in your prompts. Kelsey, Bob. Yeah. Kelsey, you should be good now. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do you see it? <clears throat> no, I'm on my phone. It keeps telling me that I'm in the oh, audience, so. Oh, yeah, do you need a different code? I don't know. I have no idea. No, the reason the reason is is that his uh, he went from his desk or his laptop to his oh. phone, and so it's once he's logged in, it won't log him back out. So, oh well, uh, okay, never mind. I'll quick give you crap then, Kelsey. <laughs> you can add you can add which ones you would have put in some of your ideas as we're waiting in the audience. Is the uh, if I go back through my browser, will it work? Uh, or is this on a one time on deal? Yes, it should. Yeah, laptop it should. Oh yeah, okay, that does work. Yay! Sticky Boom. sessions. Yes. All right. Okay. So, uh, while we're working on that, uh, a lot these prompts have been all great, uh, provided by the Kubernetes uh, community. Uh, if you want to see some of these prompts or other prompts that you have great ideas for in future episodes of DevOps Party Games, uh, on the website, you can actually suggest prompt ideas. If you roll, scroll to the very bottom of DevOpsPartyGames.com, uh, there's a form there that you can suggest uh, prompt ideas as well as a volunteer to be a part of it in the future. All right, so we are ready to hit it. All right, what do we got? KubeCon 2022 location proposal, Ooh. Alcatraz <laughs> or Denver, New York. <laughs> I want to go to Lindbergh, man. Take me to Italian. Take me to Italian. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I can firsthand vouch for the, the Italian food. Oh, in yeah, we got to do Lindbergh. Sorry. <laughs> Party. I want to see Kelsey at my local uh, pizzeria. I'll be there. It's, it's it. We're going to New York. I know, I'm going to put some weight well, on that one. Everybody wants to go to Alcatraz, apparently. Yeah, no, really wants to go to the audience. Lindbrook is not a popular place, I apparently. Did. People would rather be in jail. <laughs> Testing, actually do, normalize that, or SSH'd into the master, which I'm sure nobody ever does in production. Mm, never. never. No. Um, nope. no. no. I have never. a screen session running not on once. the master server. Not once. <laughs> Betrayed wow, by the audience. Really, uh, Ooh. They, they I like mean, that. I'd rather we SSH in than like do that privileged pod mount the host thing. I mean, I kind of like <laughs> Why doing I that. Why I got paged at 3 a.m. Escalation from a sleeping person or butt dial from the CEO? <laughs> like, what's the butt dial from the CEO at 3 a.m.? That, that just sounds problematic to begin with. <laughs> And so why are you numbering like, his phone? Hey, sir? hey, you up? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's right. So, someone called my <laughs> wife once because I wasn't answering my page. Nine, so. nine, nine That's so nine. depressing. <laughs> That's bad. Most useless vendor <laughs> swag? Literally Ooh. everything. I haven't left my house or mugs. Mugs are useful. What are you talking about? Yeah, that's that's ridiculous. I love, I love getting I really mugs. like the idea of literally everything I haven't left my house. That <laughs> channels my like 2020 energy. Like, I, I, I also love yeah. mugs. Shout out to, to Josh Burkis with all of the uh, the dope mugs for the community. Hey, right, the mugs are the people best. Cloud. 
Kelsey, what do you have against Brandon? Only thing I'll ever beat Kelsey at. So my my local uh, my local uh, Salvation Army has like a hundred thousand conference mugs. Cloud Native Cake Foundation, man. No cloud native cookie fights. I'm like a little from. Mine and Brandon and Constance Caramelis's behalf. Oh, I'm little... Okay, straight up, y'all are renaming the Cloud Native Cookie Foundation. Cake Night right. Cookie Fights, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going yeah. to be clear. I would also vote for Cake Night's Cookie Fights there. <laughs> yeah. You heard yeah. it here first, folks. CNCF, you've heard, you've heard the uh, The people have the spoken. Audience. The cloud right. is just the friends we made along the way. Or, Bob's. huh? Um, <laughs> again, these the are obviously the, the answer is the cloud is just honks. But nobody's <laughs> no, somebody, somebody really missed that opportunity there. Yeah, yeah, you definitely missed it. Cat, I think, is losing actually. Matt, no, I definitely am. Yeah, for sure. But so here's yeah. here's how I'm gonna treat this either I'm thrilled or I'm uh, mad about it. Based on what oh, I'm so sad that I didn't get this that one. Really like muted during the meeting. Meeting. I like um, you the answer is clearly because they had to like fart. Like just <laughs> I can't believe that no one put that down. <laughs> it's like big <laughs> cake energy today. <laughs> <That's> a lot. <laughs> yeah. Kat, you won't. Your position on the uh, thought leaderboard will not be affected because this is not a ranked game. Usually oh, on DevOps party games, this ends up going toward butts rather than cake. So we're doing the clean version here. Yeah, what inter <laughs> underpins our security strategy? Hope or not following Ian Coldwater, aka obscurity. <laughs> I can't comment on this. <laughs> is your name on that? I think it might be. <laughs> <laughs> you might have to look it up, baby. Oh, right. Look it up. Line, 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 line it up out of the park. Hope I, you know, uh, <laughs> well done. That deserved. It's too real. That deserved yeah. the gut. Built that one right in the gut. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So round three is coming up here, and this is where uh, it's a little bit different from previous. Uh, looks like uh, oh, Brandon's jumped ahead. Ooh, going uh, ahead. <laughs> Previous issues of the uh, uh, because all prompts lash. are in groups of but three. Now, that's right. The groups of three, and so it's a progressive. So when you see this, as it's showing you, you have a kind of a progressive <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> answers is how this should go. Okay? So it's like a humor it haiku, be, basically. Yeah. That's what we're going okay, for. Yeah. It, it will okay. be head to head against both people. Yeah, this is the yeah that was a definitely a better uh, um, a better example for sure. Now these uh, three options are going to be quite interesting to see uh, how each of the contestants here, with their uh, varying levels of uh, involvement in the game so far and where they stand, how they're going to be voted on. Some of the responses have been really good. Uh, then there was a huh in there and i'm not sure if the if, if pop understood the the question or if that was a, a why are you calling me out jeremy is this is this some like type of like thing here you said I mean, pineapple pizza was not great well, can so we I think stop talking great. about this at this point can we play the game jeremy i mean have you played your product yet? Pineapple, pineapple pizza is the thing pineapple pizza is delicious but you but, should put in your prompts instead of getting distracted by putting Pizza, right. I see what you all are doing. I was, not, all are doing. I was not intending to uh, in 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 uh, distract. But it looks like I, Pop I am only giving Pop Trump. crap in oh. particular because he forgot one time. <laughs> <laughs> he still hasn't put in. We got ten seconds. Everybody, get their props in. All right, in. we got this, everybody. Two seconds. One second. Oh, no! 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 I got distracted by the pineapple pizza thing. <laughs> I did it. Yeah, I just got mine in. I have no idea how that came out. Secure a cluster in three easy steps. Oh, Lick no. it, stick it, forget it. Or deploy from known registries, delete clusters that are not, and turn it off. Hmm. Wow. What do you do with a cluster that uh, is not? 
<laughs> you forget it? <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> How did we miss out on lay it down, flip it, and reverse it? I was about to say exactly that. Or like, that. slap that. it, yeah. bop it, yeah. Yeah. flip it. <laughs> Wait, what is a cluster that is not? Not enough characters to explain what you mean. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just delete the non-secure yeah. ones. Still no, okay, right? Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I, no, no! I like already know who the other person on this prompt was, and I think oh, no. on this prompt was is like quite yeah. obvious. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh jeez! Oh jeez! <laughs> Oh this is so close to home. <laughs> That's way too close to home. You're so good. <laughs> well, oh my god. Well done, Tabitha. Well done, Tabitha. Great job. Quite the top good. three foods in a Kubernetes contributor's fridge. <laughs> oh cake, 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 cake. <laughs> Probably some yogurt. I don't know. Cake, Slack, hug, and GitHub notifications, and then nothing. You keep them in the fridge? <laughs> The Slack and GitHub notifications they're everywhere. fill the yeah, fridge so you can't put anything out. Oh, do you have one of those like, smart fridges? Keeps them your computer. Yeah. Keeps them from overheating your computer, Cat. If you oh, okay. Fridge. That totally makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. At a certain point, you just start finding it notifications everywhere. Everywhere. <laughs> oh, so they're like, they're like hair ties Imagine for bobby pins. Right? Yes, okay. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the three sticker on Kelsey Hightower's new laptop. <laughs> no hope, no. Nope. Apple nope, Hunk nope, nope. and okay. Verify in cold water. I like them both, though. It's That's clearly so hard. hard. How do you? Vote? Yeah. It's it's definitely clearly the Apple Hunk and a Verify in cold water. I'm a I minimalist. Like okay, so remember that. Like so that was rhyme. actually literally it's, exactly the joke that Kelsey is a minimalist. Like that's why we came up with this prompt. <laughs> <laughs> I love this prompt. Hmm. I feel no, like I was personally people know me well. This one, by the way, like, I'm ashamed that I lost it. I think I got dumpstered. All right, so where does this sit? Uh, yeah. Oh! Yes. 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 Stop taking the food! Yeah! Nice, 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 nice. I don't even know chicken dinner. I know how to pander. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> I know how to pander. <laughs> oh, no, that's All funny. right, so whoever still sees this on your phone, if you can grab that link that's uh, that shows on there and post it into the... Uh, main chat for everybody that's on the stream to be able to see for future. It's all good. All right, so uh, fantastic. All right, so we are going to get set for the next round. Um, oh, Matt's wait. Added some how do I comments there? <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Right. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop our sharing. We're gonna go to the next game. Meanwhile, vamp away. <sighs> All right. Mm. I'm going to go drop the link in the Twitch chat. Is a good idea. Uh, do, 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 do. So All we're right. playing Drawful now, I believe, right? Or everybody's yes. signing up for Drawful. Drawful which is like Pictionary, explain... sort of. Is this, this, is, this is one where switching to your phone may be advantageous. Yes, this will not actually a uh, if you decide to use your um, uh, a tablet, it actually does not give you the added benefits that you think it might. So we are going to have a new room code for the uh, those to join here in a second. And did we ever get this working on Kubernetes YouTube? Does anybody know? Uh, no, I believe they just switched over to Twitch. Fair enough. Yeah. And is this the All same right. link or a new link? Yeah, what, what is it this? Will be a new link I am getting for you right now. Okay. Who wants to regale us with a uh, Kubernetes excitement that they've had recently? 
or what they're looking forward to this weekend. Don't, don't all stand up at once. <laughs> well, I think everybody saw like me and Ian's Kubernetes excitement recently. So, Docker so Sim. <laughs> so the Bake Off is tomorrow, and I'm really excited about the Bake Off because people are going to be baking off with a Kubernetes theme. It is great British Bake Off themed. I believe that Kat is helping host. AB from CNCF is judging. Paris will be on it. It will be a good time. Everybody should come. And what time I'm is that? I'm just sad I'm not going to be able to eat anything. What yeah. time will that be tomorrow? That's a great question. Is it 12? Hold on. I should know. I'm going. <laughs> Also, we're doing another edition of this party games with a different group of guests tomorrow morning um, for to make it a more Euro EMEA friendly time zone. So that will be at uh, 11 o'clock central time. Uh, translate that into whatever time makes sense for you. That will be yeah, the, the next to... session of this is at 9 a.m. Pacific and the next the cl great cloud native bake off is at 12 p.m. Pacific time. And Sarah Novotny is co-hosting with Kat, which means it's going to be extra super oh, awesome. So everybody come I'm watch that. It's going to be hilarious. Who's right. also on episode 50 of the podcast. Just want to throw a little shameless plug out there. Oops, sorry. <laughs> and whoever, thank one, you for that. One. You're welcome. <laughs> You're just going to have to eat right, pineapple so pizza. So everybody. That's right. That's right. No more I'm pineapple over. pizza. Okay, so uh, everybody, whoever is the VIP, if you go ahead and hit that, everybody's in. And. So oh, hit the... Sarah is participating because she wanted to bake. And Tim and this commenter are co-hosting with Kat. So that is going to be a good time all around. Yeah, that's Matt Berber. Hey, Jeremy, I think I have the button. Do I just press everybody's okay. in or do I go custom yes. episodes? Yes. Christoph, hit the uh, everybody's in. Okay. Let it ah! All right. So. Drawful two. Everybody drew everybody, themselves. Everybody, everybody has drawn a nice little representation of themselves. <laughs> During this time, they are seen on their screens a prompt of something that they should draw uh, this is where you really get to see the diversity of uh, somebody's ability to um, draw or not uh, typically when I play this uh, I'm re I'm soundly booted off because my I, I cannot draw but I that's can't okay. draw either I, uh, I have not let it affect me at while all. we're are waiting for the players here to draw. Don't forget to join the audience so you can vote on your favorites. Visit Jackbox TV and enter the code EQCU. I'm going to keep that up for the duration of the draw thing. That How is do you a, erase? Oh, this is terrible. Oh, you can't. <laughs> There's an <laughs> audience. <laughs> <laughs> you can't try to do it. <laughs> colors, <laughs> but there is no Yeah, there is oh, no erasing, yeah. so. Yeah, I'm not. If you do get to come. Yikes. Out. Okay. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. All right. Sure, so, boy. Ryle, in the meantime, as we're getting down to the last uh, few seconds <laughs> of, of this here, uh, do not forget to go uh, out to devopspartygames.com. Uh, you can see our next episode coming up uh, on the, uh, let's see, it's December, if I remember right is uh next week next next tuesday next tuesday even so it's december 15th uh is going to be the next episode check that out at devopspartygames.com come join us all the hilarity uh tuesday december 15th uh magnified to an even better uh even even larger extent as we uh step away from just Kubernetes content to a variety of DevOps and tech related, which in all fairness does come back to Kubernetes content as well. All right, so last couple of people left to draw. Looks like who's the last person we're waiting on to draw? Kelsey. It's green. Green no, side. It's not night. Kelsey. Kelsey's <laughs> it's like, it's like thanks for time. your drawing. Okay, and I'm like, are you go. sure? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're sure. So, what is sure. this? Right. What is what um, is it's some dockers is it 
A, it's at least a orchestrator? Lot of whales, but I the whales weren't in Kubernetes anymore. So is it whale copters? That's what's hanging out over my house? That makes sense. Oof. That that does whale copters. That makes a lot of sense. Um and it's all great. I like the I do like the <laughs> use of <laughs> Is there a slingshot? Are they are they getting a slingshot the at the whale? Uh <laughs> <laughs> or a pen they're really... trying to draw it. What is it is holding? This a meta? They're trying to draw it at the same time? It's KubeCon. <laughs> huh. Truth, it's KubeCon. Yeah. yeah. We do need a goose with a rocket launcher. <laughs> a rocket yeah. launcher. We got that earlier today, didn't we? <laughs> we did. Thanks, Tony the Scribe. You're watching that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, Almost what there. is it? Everybody, we're still waiting on two. Did they not get it in? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Minneapolis, I'm definitely getting my vote. I will, I will say a few of these, uh, if you didn't get your name in there, will be randomly entered by the game. So, uh, yeah. I mean, mm. it's probably a few of these are, are those options. Man, <laughs> there's some good... Like, yeah, these are fantastic. Uh, got, Docker powered police helicopters, Minneapolis, Docker swarm rip, a fleet of containers, a couple of container orchestrations. How babies are made then? That was a decoy. Somebody didn't get theirs in. Oh. You chose the decoy. Oh. Don't feel bad. It sounded right. I could I could see that being some whale storks. Docker this one storks. is my favorite. That one gets my vote for sure. Bamboo. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good one. Container orchestrator. Darn, Steven. <laughs> that, that works. Container, Container orchestration. orchestration. This was ah! the actual title. Good job. So Tabitha not only gets those, gets extra points because it was the actual one and people oh, got so to choose. Yeah. However, so, Minneapolis ah, won, yeah. which is correct. Mm. So. <laughs> wait, so wait, that wasn't how they What's did it? No. So what is it this? Isn't. We can talk about that after. This is a goose all. wearing a crown and honking. I mean, if you can if you can write that, I'm sure that's it. <laughs> goose wearing a crown and honking, or a honking goose with a crown. There are a lot of geese in this game. That's true. There are a lot of geese there, Matt. This Shout is Ian cosplaying cats. <laughs> so to answer your question, Justin, uh, the custom list of drawful words came from the Kubernetes community. There were a few people that helped curate some great, co uh, great uh, content. And we uh, Jeff and I wrote them together. <laughs> okay, so Jeff works. and Ian wrote those together, and uh, uh, yeah, similar to every. Um, DevOps Party Game is episode. Okay. Mm. Uh, there's a few that already kind of stand up. Uh, All right. The Royal Inn. That's good. Knit again. Um, uh, CN, the honk, CNCF Honk Ambassador. So that would be the... the wh What did we say was cake... cake uh, what did CNCF stand for? Uh, cake Night Cookie, cookie, cookie Fight. fight. Yeah. Game, game, game Dex Dex could be fine. Say there's, that. <laughs> there's me, wow. there's CNCF Ambassador <laughs> of the Year, there's Sig Honk, Kubernetes Security, Midas's Golden Goose, question mark, and Sig Security. We've got a theme here, I think. I don't know what Definitely the theme is, but I'm pretty sure we've got one. I don't see it. Personally. Justin is wondering, how do I play with that list? And the answer is we could probably hand it to you. I don't like that hyphen again. I... <laughs> Actually, SIG Honk right. uses the right. guard on purpose to differentiate it from a real SIG. Style guard! <laughs> <laughs> See, the problem is all of your answers are too similar, which means that there's no, like, there's no, there's no hook to vote for one particular one. That's why I went with CNCF Ambassador of the Year. It's like, but you got to be right, too, right? <laughs> I mean, but this is the apples to apples part. Like, you can either be right or you can just be funny. I'm going for funny. Why not both? Why not both? Ooh. 
It, why not? I want it all. Always the end. <laughs> okay. All right. In, in all of it, you shall have. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, somebody started to draw something and then realized that they could not uh, erase it and so justified it to go with this is fine. <laughs> Which makes me wonder what was actually written underneath there. <laughs> I, I know the answer to this one. Uh, literally everybody <laughs> is, uh, yeah. it's 2020, 2020, 2020 yeah. illustrated. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. uh, right. You are so... welcome. You can, uh, you can award me for quoting the style guide any old time. Uh, 2020, right. 2020. Two twenty twenties. Hindsight is twenty twenty. Yeah, think we got a theme happening here. All of those. That's Hopefully not twenty twenty one. Go hang up grades. Y'all are getting way too deep. Yeah. SS ship it. SS ship yep. it. Oh my god. Docker shim deprecation. I think this one is my oh favorite. My god. <laughs> yeah, that is good. That's real good. 2020 dumpster fire. Basil. I is really it basil like or basil? looks at butterfly. Is this basil? basil? basil. Looks at butterfly. Is this basil? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That's good. That's good. Go laying upgrades though. That's that's uh that's on point. Yep, on too point. real. Oh no! The cake burned after a bug in production. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. All right, you only got a couple more seconds. Audience votes are uh, are definitely in. It's going well. We could get more people in the audience though. Go to Jackbox.tv. Was that the Steven? Nice, very nice. That was so go good. <laughs> I like that you suggested Basil and then you voted Golang, Steven. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, well, you can't, can't, vote. can't vote for your own thing. Hmm. 2020, says Kelsey, right. which is absolutely correct. Fair. I mean, DNS is just assumed. It's, it's implied. Really. <laughs> oh, <laughs> gosh, we really missed out on DNS. Yeah, you're right, you're right. 2020, okay. Basil is, is the actual is title. title. If you somebody said so service mesh. Steven, you had to be funny. I had to, <laughs> see? see? It had to be <laughs> funny. Good. 2020 is the DNS. That is too real. I love it. <laughs> keep, keep the comments coming. Those are good. Uh, okay. This, this might have been able to use a, a couple extra um, colors in this one. DNS should be renumbered to RFC 2020. Oof. Here we go. Yes. And that's, Yike. that's good. That is uh, my. Yep. Can't argue with that. Could not be better. Yep. Yeah. Uh, let me keep that one up for a moment. If you haven't joined the audience yeah. yet, don't forget to join the audience. Visit Jackbox TV, enter EQCU. And what do you suppose this is, Jeremy? You know, I, I, I wonder, it, it seems a lot like Twitter with bread for shoes. <laughs> with bread for, bread for yes. shoes. I'm you are like a very polite man. man. You are very polite man. man. Yeah. I, I, that's, I mean, that's all that comes to mind. I can't imagine what else. Oh, no. <laughs> all right. Our choices here include Hipster IRC, Honkbot, Having Your Name Trending, Service Mess, Ian Coldwater, Look It Up Dot Baby, which is a real website, Shitpost, New Fleets Iconography. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> <laughs> Twitter huh. driven to Hipster development. IRC. Like I, 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 that actually, uh, that hits home for some people. <laughs> Hipster IRC. Didn't someone recently call it like uh, Reader's Digest for Generation X? Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that, that just keeps on giving. Beautiful. Solid. That was Solid. Beautiful. Yep. Shit posting. <laughs> is the actual title. Right. Well done, cat. That 
was good. <laughs> this is because I got a whole bunch of uh, trash talk in Twitch for doing poorly in the first round. So, Matt? So coming okay. strong. Coming back strong. <laughs> what is that? What? By the way, okay, look, look it up, baby. Cloudy, like, cloudy, that's cloudy, baby right? did, did Arrow? Uh, okay, so this is the one that somebody mixed. I think Steven... Uh, no, uh, no, that was not. I do not claim that. <laughs> Bear, so, so this this is this is very telling, right here. This one looks it is, like it my is bare George's metal bare metal, metal network topology. <laughs> that looks like J Jason D. Tiberius' beard. Oh, yeah. It's not the right color. I don't know. I, like I. I, All right, I don't even know. I, I don't know. But this internet. is where this is where you have to be funny, Stephen. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I'm going to do I got this. There's some good. There's some good ones. Of course, Sasha with. It's not a butt, Sasha. Maybe a cat hey. boo. Oh. oh. All right, we got looks that, that, at that butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> Dropping knowledge, son. RFC 2020. When a race is not an option. Basil. Crash loop back off. Prow and Colonel Panic. What do you think, everybody? Wow. <laughs> wow. Colonel Panic for me, like that. That actually. Uh, that does. That does speak. I the four-way really combo nothing. of Basil, Crash Loop, Back Off, Prow, and Colonel Panic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Basil hurt someone. <laughs> like, I maintain at least three of the things that you keep talking about. Like this, this cuts me deeper. Right now. Something yeah. panicked, but I don't think it was the colonel. Nope. I'm panicking. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> <Didn't do it. laughs> that is a good choice. Audience, twenty five percent, twenty six percent of the audience enjoyed that one. Looks I'm very funny, funny, Jeremy. Jeremy. Is this Basil? <laughs> what was that, Kat? I'm very funny, Jeremy. <laughs> I, hey, I just, yeah, just, if you, maybe if you stated didn't more say times. You <laughs> Basil hurt a lot of people. You're right, Josh. You're right. Actually, back up. Hey. Oh, what really there good is. job illustrating that. Good job. That's a very good drawing of a crashly back up. It's very hard to draw something that abstract. It is, but you really, you really nailed I it. I think, yeah, you have a crash and a thin loop. So. It's really, it's that sad face at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> that uh, was my T dot to P dot. T, T dot to P dot. Huh. I mean, that's uh, what I see. I wrote these clues, and I have no idea what this is. <laughs> Welcome to our uh, our normal DevOps party games. Fair enough. <laughs> What? To put these in and go. I have. I don't even remember what that one is. <laughs> Log logical proof of some for shopping, shopping in 2020. 2020. What my local store is missing. <laughs> Prom hub. <laughs> no. Uh -oh. Toilet paper crisis of 2020, though. I, I yeah. you have to yeah. give, uh, give that one. That's that's quite well. Glass and tea, killing the game. I have no idea, man. Like, I don't know. I got nothing. I, I, nothing. I absolutely yeah. am, I have no idea. Like <laughs> after the after the crash loop <laughs> one too. Like this is very I, opaque. I'm has so some, curious. Has I some, have some, to know. Yeah. All right, we've got <laughs> replica <laughs> set controller. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die historic on the Fury Road. <laughs> Testing introduction. Beavis looks at this butterfly. Is this service mesh? Proofa, team I'm player, question mark, question here. mark, question mark, and turbo panic. <laughs> I, 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 feel, I feel like there's a story of if I'm going to die, I'm going to die historic on the Fury Road. Like, what what part of this drawing brought back that memory? I mean, it is right next to testing in production, so maybe that's what happens when you test on production is you die historic on the Fury Road. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> I mean, aren't we all that's... testing a production with this climate crisis thing? And isn't that just going to lead us to die historic on the Fury Road? 
Just killing it. <laughs> yeah, who is who is Glass and T like killing it with the comments, honestly? Yeah. Yeah. I keep hiding this and you keep showing it. I'm hiding it again. <laughs> okay. So. There's, a, there's a, a half second delay every time we, we yeah, it's, it's quite good. Okay, so uh, Cat again in production. is just outpacing everybody else with with these. This is that's uh, very funny. I'm Cat is oh, wow. number one on the thought leaderboard on Real DevOps Party Cat, Games too. You just re- what Cat, is you this? Just this to yourself is in the third person. No, a that cell phone else. tower that people are running a maypole on. Is that what oh, this is? maypole. Okay, that's I. That's good. There's a sun a in the side, so it's like it's it's like springtime. It's five G. Sunbathing outside a teepee. Five G. 5G COVID spreader, in fact. Yep. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, you got both of those in there. 5G and COVID spreader. That, we we need glass and tea. We need some, some glass and tea up in here. Somebody says Burning Man. <laughs> KubeCon ah, Midsummer. Nice. nice. <laughs> Kill that's, me. Again, that's, that's good. And again, yes, another darn thing. <laughs> Who beat Saver Netties? Midsummer. Oh, Post COVID party. 5G COVID broadcaster. Cl- global warming. Basil Effigy. <laughs> Paris. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> and TP crisis of 2021. Like, this is like, me explaining service match to my colleagues. Right. A terrible Ingress diagram. Yeah. <laughs> I am here for that post COVID party, though. I am, I am down. That's going to be a good party. Like, it looks pretty it's epic, pretty honestly. Epic. Yeah. There is there is a lot of just pure chaotic energy so, in this there's a lot set of answers. Of like, I can <laughs> anything. It, it could be any of these yeah. things. It could be any of these things. And none of them make sense in the no, context of the No, none of them make for the next generation. <laughs> none of them make sense. <laughs> Good. I typed that before the Slack or whatever. Just you know, <coughs> steal from the audience. It is in fact Paris. Well done, Kelsey. Well done, Kelsey. Good job. There you go. Good work, Kelsey. That was great points. Yeah. But it was not enough to make any dent in Cat's dominance at the moment. Getting murdered here. We are getting murdered here. I agree. <laughs> uh, Murder. Paris the city or Paris the Pitman? Apparently Paris the city because there was an Eiffel Tower. C- what is <laughs> C- this? What? Sig test? Oh my god. Uh, it, is a, uh, it is Steven wearing a cardboard box on his head with a tinfoil robot costume at the next Sig late night party. I, has has <laughs> that not happened already? Way too many. Way too many characters to be typed in, but highly specific. <laughs> <laughs> Working group robots. That's like the Edge API, like IoT one, right? Yeah. I don't understand the significance of that square around its body. I am going to be honest with you. I thought this was like a swivelly desk chair. <laughs> you're, you're happy ergonomic chair just like come on sit down just chilling just sit down on me. <laughs> in which case why does that i'll it's keep your back test. healthy put your butt on me i don't know i don't know okay, okay. So what is it it's oh god i know what it is oh my god, god. 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 Uh, oh, I'm so upset. Yeah, Stephen Augustus. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? Dude, change your Twitter profile to that. <laughs> <laughs> we will be able to grab these uh, afterwards, hopefully. And uh, Stephen, you can use that as your profile picture. I just made my contact on my phone that for Stephen. It's a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> <laughs> Though existential crisis, I think, is very 2020. But isn't Steven an existential crisis? Just generally speaking. <laughs> I mean, we've got a testing here. robot overlord got equated to be in this. this. Like, clearly, Steven is the testing robot overlord. <laughs> yeah, well. Complete <laughs> bloop. I agree. Yeah. 
slash retest. All right. Slack command, it looks like. Steven. <laughs> I support you, Celeste. <laughs> I bought. Actual title. There you go. It's good. Well done, Steven. <laughs> wow. 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 Uh, of course. That continues of her course. position as top of the of DevOps course. thought leaderboard. But this is where we get to see the audience. The audience loved Stevens more than the players did. So <laughs> well done. Well done. I'll take right, it. So I'll take it. Wow. 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 To all your doing is... fans. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that has brought us to, um, oh, wow, that's quite bigger than we wanted. All right, there we go. Uh, <laughs> that has brought us to the end of the uh, amazing, most excellent Kubernetes challenge. Uh, I want to thank each one of the participants um, going down the list. Uh, Tabitha, Kelsey, Kat, Christoph, Pop, Celeste, Brandon, Stephen, uh, thank you so much, Ian. Thank you for joining me. Uh, do you have any parting comments uh, from any of the players? Um, no, you. No, you. <laughs> what he said. All right. All right. We will be doing this again in the morning um, right. at uh, 11 a.m. Central Time. We will be streaming for the EMEA audience with a different set of players. Um, we would love it if you joined us, especially if this time zone doesn't work for you. And also, if it doesn't, thank you so much for you all in the audience watching the stream. Thank you all so much to the players. This has been awesome. Thank, thank you. you. To our host. Glad, to, glad to be here. Thank you very much again. Like Ian said, see you all tomorrow.